up beautiful people welcome back to my channel it's your girl star flames tv rewinds no guys i have been checking out some articles and i'm realizing that there is definitely a fallacious attack against Kanye West. And I said to myself, you know that Kanye West is a lot smarter than what we think? Listen, Kanye is not perfect. And everyone makes mistakes and at times say dumb things. We all do. No matter how smart or educated we are, we all do that. But when you look at the time that Kanye West decided that he's going to step back from social media, he's going to stop posting. And I'm saying, it seems as though Kanye West knew what was coming next. It seems as though he knew that people were going to start doing crazy stuff and then blame him for them. No. What am I talking about? Let's tell you guys what I'm talking about. When you look at what the media is reporting at this time, they are reporting so many attacks against the Jewish community, right? We hear of cemetery being vandalized. We hear of laser writings on buildings saying Kanye was right about the Jews. No, I'm going to say this, and I'm going to say this without any apology because I've been talking to some people. We've been talking back and forth, you know, sharing our opinion and stuff. Why is it that we're seeing where there's attacks on all things Jewish, but there's no retaliation, right? Because at this time, the black community and the Jewish community, you know, there's tension between both communities. There's tension between us, and we cannot dismiss that. So why is it that it's just the Jews who are being attacked? Why is it that the blacks aren't being attacked as well? I'm going to tell you why. It is because no one is attacking anyone. What these people are doing, they have realized that Kanye cannot be canceled. And because they realize that Kanye cannot be canceled, they are going the extra mile to prove their point. Do you see all these things that they're saying, you know, people are doing, you know, in support of Kanye West? I don't believe that. I believe that this is coming from either someone who is mischievous enough, who doesn't care about anything that's going on, and to make the Jewish community seem as though they were right, or it's coming from the Jewish community directly. But I'm more likely to believe that it's coming from the Jewish community because I'm checking every resources that are available to me and we've only heard of one instance and that was last week when a restaurant in I think it was either Atlanta or New York was sent you know something derogatory something racist but other than that we're not hearing any form of back and forth between both communities we're just hearing that you know laser beams and things being written up everywhere saying Kanye was right and I don't believe that this is anyone else but the Jewish community I'm sorry for saying it but that's how I see it because we don't see anyone you know besides their little subliminals on Twitter I don't see anything else coming from the black community and there is tension again between both communities and normally it would be back and forth the black community does something the jewish community retaliates no it is just no it is no it seems as though it's just the black community retaliating against the jewish community and as such i believe that no one is attacking the Jewish community with those vandalism and those laser beam writings saying Kanye was right. I believe it's member from the Jewish community who are doing this. That is what I believe. And when I say Kanye is smart and Kanye is way wiser than what we think, if you look at the time that Kanye chose to get off social media, Kanye came off social media because he said it Everything that is happening now, Kanye said it. Kanye said that 
things are about to go down. They are going to do things to make it seem as though it is the ninjas who are doing it. They're going to do things to make us look bad as though we are retaliating. He said it. And now we're seeing where that came to pass. Kanye told us that we're going to hear a lot of horrible stories about it because this is how they roll. And we're seeing where that is now coming to pass. So Kanye took time off social media because he knows that if, if he's there posting, people are going to say he's sending subliminals to carry out this attack and that attack. So Kanye chose the best timing possible to get off social media. I don't think anyone is attacking this community. And I'm not alone in this. Many people believe so. But that's all I want to share in this video with you guys. Let me know what your thoughts are. While you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Thanks for your time. Stay safe, stay blessed. See you all next time. Bye, guys.